Technology transfer is the process by which one party systematically transfers to another the knowledge for the manufacture of a product, the application of a process, or the rendering of a service, which may involve the transfer, assignment, or licensing of intellectual property rights. Under Article 1, Section 2 of Republic Act No. 10055, the state acknowledges that the successful transfer of government-funded R&D results depend on the proper management of intellectual property, development of capacity by RDIs to become self-sustaining and competitive, and an enhancing interaction and cooperation with the private sector, particularly small and medium enterprises, through collaborative and contract research based on equitable, fair access, and mutual benefit for all involved partners. Is it important? Yes. Through technology transfer, technology adopters learn new ways of producing products and providing services in a more efficient way. Manual grinding of coffee beans takes longer, but with the innovation of technology, we do away with laborious grinding. It is fast and easy. Through technology transfer, adopters are able to expand their market. Manually printing t-shirts means less production. But with the use of a printing technology, more products can be produced, which redounds to more customers. Through technology transfer, adopters are able to commercialize healthy and marketable products. Government-funded technologies underwent strenuous research and development. Thus, the product outcomes are safer and healthier. How to be a technology adopter or licensee? Submission of letter of intent. The prospective adopter submits a letter of intent to the Research and Development Institute. The RDI coordinates with the prospective adopter to discuss the terms of the licensing agreement. RDI conducts an ocular inspection or technology needs assessment if necessary to validate or match technology needs based on existing resources. The RDI prepares a draft of the licensing agreement and presents the agreement to the prospective technology adopter for review prior to finalization. In case of direct negotiation for the technology commercialization agreement, the RDI submits a letter of intent to the DOST Regional Office concerned for the issuance of a Fairness Opinion Report from a third-party body composed of experts. Processing the Issuance of Fairness Opinion Report The RDI submits a letter of request with the complete requirements to the DOST Regional Office. Upon receipt of letter requests and requirements, the DOSC Regional Office checks the completeness of the document submitted. Three members of the Fairness Opinion Board with legal, financial, and technical expertise are constituted by the DOST Secretary through a special order. Opinion Board conducts a maximum of three meetings to discuss the documents submitted, interview the licensor and potential adopter, and perform ocular visits when necessary. The Fairness Opinion Board issues the Fairness Opinion Report and the DOSD Secretary thereafter issues the written recommendation. Fairness Opinion Board evaluation is conducted to ensure that the technology transfer transaction is fair to both the technology generator and the adopter, particularly the technical and legal aspects, and most importantly, its financial terms. Lastly, the adopter commercializes the technology, and the DOST Regional Office subsequently monitors and gets feedback from the licensee. Technology adopter and enhance your business.
promoting transfer and commercialization of intellectual property and bringing SMT solutions to the public.